Welcome back to Dawn's Life, welcome to the channel, thanks for joining today. Today we're going to take another look at an offering from Blue Eddy, the AC180 portable power station. Let's go. Blue Eddy has this brand new power station on the market, I've agreed to review it. Let's take a closer look at some of the features. This gives us 1800 watts of AC output. It can even do some heavy lifting for a short period of time, all the way up to 2700 watts. That'll give us 1152 watt hours, over nine different output connections, and a tenth on top for your wireless charger. We can recharge it multiple ways. Plug it into AC. We can charge it in the vehicle. We can even connect it with an optional solar panel up to 500 watts. With solar in the right conditions, you can charge this in as little as three hours. This has fast charging available, 1440 watts, they call it turbo mode. You can take this from zero to 80% in 45 minutes. That means in one hour, you can have this thing fully charged and get a day's use out of it, no problem. And like other Blue Eddy portable power stations, as your needs grow, you can add extra batteries. We now have a smart control feature using Bluetooth with the Blue Eddy app, so we can check on what's going on at all times. Let's demonstrate just how easy this is to use. So first we're gonna turn it on. You'll see our display, we have our input watts on the left, we have our output on the right. We're at 60 hertz, that can be changed to 50 hertz for frequency. We're also in eco mode. What that's going to do is if there's no power being drawn for a certain period of time, it's actually going to shut down. So first I'm going to demonstrate AC mode. Just press the button, AC is now on. These are actually illuminated, but because it's a little bright out here, it's a little hard to see, but that's green right now where DC is not on, so it's not illuminated. I'm going to plug in a couple devices here. I've got a heat gun and I've got a battery charger. The battery charger is active. It should start pulling power right away. And that's going to keep drawing the power that it needs, topping out around 70 some watts. Now we're going to turn on the heat gun. And that's full. So right there we're doing some heavy lifting. Step it down a bit. Put it on the lowest setting. And then off. So you hear the fan kicked in because it was doing the heavy lifting part by going to that peak output that we needed. We can use DC at the same time. Push the button, plug in your device, it'll start charging. Or you could use USB-C and a whole bunch of USB-A ports. Or maybe you just want to charge your phone wirelessly on the top. On the side here you have your AC input, circuit breaker, ability to ground the unit, cooling fan, convenient carry handles your user manual, and your warranty registration card. Let's take a closer look at exactly what the app does for us. So we're just in uh, standby mode there. You see the app shows exactly what's on the screen. And we're charging a phone right now, and we're also charging that battery. Now on here, I can turn on or off the DC. So now it just turned off DC. It turned off on here. I'm gonna turn it back on. Now it just turned it back on. Same thing with AC, turn it off. All very simple. Turn it back on, now it's on. You also are able to see your battery information, how many battery packs you have. We have the one built-in battery pack, but if I was to add extra batteries, this is where you would see them. Take a look at our settings. This is where you'd access your user manual. We have our standard charging mode. This is where you would turn on your silent or turbo charging. Turbo can diminish your overall battery life, so you wouldn't want to use it in every situation. You'd want to use it on standard or silent. We have our eco mode, which is on by default. Again, if nothing is being drawn from the portable generator, the unit will shut itself off after a certain period of time. And then we have power lifting mode, which will allow us to draw that extra current, like when we were running the heat gun. 
and it will be able to do that for a set amount of time. So as you can see, the app is an essential companion to gain access to all the features. So you might be asking yourself, how would I benefit from using a device like this? Well, I have 10 suggestions for you. Number one would be versatility. With its decent power rating, it will power a wide range of not only your electronics, such as your phone, camera, laptop, tablet, but even small appliances like a coffee maker. Number two, and it's a big one, an emergency power backup. Maybe you have an unstable connection. We're camping right now. We certainly have an unstable connection. I could use this on the camper or in my home office have this plugged into the grid, and then if the power goes out, everything will run through this. So essentially you could use it like a UPS, an uninterrupted power supply. Number three, portability. At 35 pounds, you can pretty much pick this up and take it anywhere, whether it be camping, road trips, wherever you need to get it, it's small enough and light enough, you can take it there. And number four, it's a clean energy source. You can run this indoors without any harmful emissions. Number five, it's quiet. Unlike conventional generators, it's near silent operations, not gonna annoy you by using it, and certainly won't annoy any neighbors if they're nearby. And on that note, it brings me to number six. You have no dependency on fuel. That means you don't have to worry about storing fuel to keep topping it back up. And number seven, multiple recharge options. We can charge this thing in under an hour to get a full day of power out of it. Number eight, off-grid living. If that's something you wanna do, your equipment list would not be fulfilled without something like this to take care of those needs. And number nine, I actually found that I've used this one a few times for this, but power for outdoor activities where power isn't available. Maybe you just wanna have a party in your backyard and you don't wanna have to run extension cords everywhere. You can power up your entertainment equipment for the whole time, easy. I find myself using this Blue Eddy more and more and it's a fixture in my busy lifestyle. I recently used it to do some electrical work on my vehicle and plugged my soldering iron and heat gun directly into the unit to get everything repaired. Then I charged it using the 12 volt charging on my way to the next destination. I'd like to thank Blue Eddy for letting me try the AC180. If you wanna check out more of Blue Eddy's products, including this one, head over to Blue Eddy's website. I'll leave more information in the video description down below. But if you like today's video, hit that like button. Please consider subscribing. We'll talk to you next time.